welcome to another fun-filled half hour of great country music on the Wilburn Brothers Show with Loretta Lynn, Harold Morrison, our special guest, Sarah and Maybell, the original Carter family. And now, here is America's number one female country singer, Miss Loretta Lynn. <laughs> Well, on a Friday night, you draw your pay and you take in the town. You leave me at home just to lose my mind while you're out messing around. Well, it's four in the morning and you're staggering in and you sure look a mess. With a smile on your face and outstretched arms and a bargain basement dress. Get your arms around me Well, you say when a man works hard all week He deserves the pay or rest Well, honey, that ain't right So get out of my side with that bargain basement dress I wouldn't wear that dress to a dog fight If the fight was free And a bargain basement dress ain't enough To get your arms around me Thank you so much. Off to a good start with Loretta Lynn doing the bargain basement dress. And it's sort of a special occasion on the Wilburn Brothers show this week because we have the original Carter family, Mother Maybell and Sarah with us, and uh, listened to many of their records years and years ago, and it's wonderful having them with us. We know that you're going to enjoy them. And we'll be with them. Uh, I believe Doyle has something else before that, though. I don't know what. I was wondering who that little old short fat girl is up playing on the porch. Oh, that was that little short man's little short fat girl. That you. It was your girl. <laughs> it's Cheryl. Oh, that's Cheryl. Oh, okay. <laughs> Let's get Harold Morrison out here for a while. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. And another little short fat fellow approaching. <laughs> How you doing, Ho? I'm fine, Mr. Morrison. Oh, I, I seen the wildest thing yesterday. What'd you see? I was driving along the road home, you know, mm -hmm. and I was following a guy in a car. He was going, oh, he, he was whipping right along there, you know, at a pretty good pace. And all of a sudden, he went off the left shoulder, the right shoulder, turned over three times, come back up on the road and went off on the right shoulder and turned over two times, popped back up on the road on its wheel. And by the time I got stopped, this fella had got out, you know, dusting himself off. And I jumped out and run up there. I said, are you hurt? He said, I ain't hurt. I got up close and I said, I said, you're drunk. He said, you're dang right I'm drunk. You don't think I'm a stunt driver, do you? <laughs> <laughs> Yahoo, Mountain Dew. They call it that Mountain Dew. Lord, he sawed off the short and he measured 
is about four foot two. Why he thinks he's a giant when you give him a pint of that good old mountain dew. Mighty fine, Harold. Good old Mountain Dew. You got a little dance there, I see. You've entered a dance in your act with two dancers. <laughs> There's no telling what's going to happen a little later, so don't go away. First, let's watch this message. Sharon, when I was a little boy about your size and Teddy, Mom and Dad Wilburn used to order records by the Carter family from a mail order house. We had stacks of them. And uh, the house burned and burned all the records up. And this is about the only way that we can really get an authentic sample of what the original Carter family sounded like. There are special guests this week on the Wilburn Brothers show. I'd like for you to join me and make welcome Sarah and Maybelle no, Carter. Not you. Away by the river so clear. The ladies were winding their way And Pharaoh's little daughter stepped down in the water To bathe in the cool of the day Before it was dark she opened the ark And found the sweet infant was there And thought him so pretty And it made little Moses so glad She called him her own Her beautiful son And sent for a nurse that was near She called him her own Her beautiful son And sent for a nurse that was near Did all that she could to rear him and teach him with care. His mother so good, done all that she could to rear him and teach him with care. And away by the sea that was red, little Moses, a servant of God, while in him he was divided as a bird, he lifted his rod. The Jews saved the cross while Pharaoh's host was grounded in the waters and lost. The Jews saved the cross while Pharaoh's host was grounded in the waters and lost. Just to be where you are That's enough for me Just to be where you are That's happiness for me Any place, anywhere I'll be happy if you're there, that's my heart's desire, just to be where you are, I may never see, or 
fortune smiled for me or behold my name in our Satisfied, I found my place in the sun just to be where you are. That's enough for me just to be where you are. That's happiness for me. place anywhere I'll be happy if you're there that's my heart's desire just to be where you are nothing beats the classics on OMC the Outlaw Music Channel. You want me to prove my love for you. I'm surprised that the way you're asking me to. You've Seems like they kind of get in the way. They raise a big family, and then they're left alone. 
sent off somewhere to live in an old folks home. Oh, they'd like to be with their children, but they don't want to impose. For you might have to wash out some of their faded old clothes. Yes, they've nursed you and they raised you until you were grown. But that's the thanks they get for all of this. A place in an old folks home. Do you remember the many nights they sat beside your bed and mom would place a cool cloth to your hot feverish head? And she'd say, now don't you worry, it'll be all right, dear. For your mama and your daddy, we're gonna be sitting right here. While they'd sit there through the long night, and then when daylight came, mom and dad would go on with their hard day's work, and you'd never hear them complain. They nursed you because they loved you, while you were their very own. And now, I can't understand how you leave them out there, living in an old folks home. Oh, you have a beautiful place to live in. You're driving a brand new car. Mom and Dad would sure enjoy those comforts you enjoy living there where you are. Still, you live there in splendor, just like a king on a throne. And they're left somewhere neglected by you, living in an old folks home. Well, you have a nice room right, right there at the head of the stairs, and a big, soft bed, and there's no one sleeping there. You have a big yard out back, all full of pretty flowers. Why don't you bring them back from that old folks home so their last hours will be happy hours? What will happen to your mama and daddy after they have grown old? Hey, Bell, how does it feel to have Big Sis standing beside you again singing? <laughs> oh, it's wonderful, Noel. That's We're, real good. I'm just tickled to death that we got to cut a, another album together. Mm -hmm. That and is And this tremendous. is a tune out of the album. Sarah, how do you feel well, with the I auto harp back on your shoulder I feel again? wonderful. <laughs> and I want to say a hello to everyone out there, and I'm happy to be here again. <laughs> That's wonderful. Ladies and gentlemen, the original Carter family, make them welcome back for another song. Will you please? <laughs> On a day when soldiers rode the line to those they loved, to mothers, wives, and sweethearts far away. When a fair heart voice sat dreaming of a far off southern town, of a dark eyed maid who's waiting day by day. While the band is playing Dixie, I'm humming home sweet home. It takes me back to Georgia, though I'm far across the phone. Once again beside the river with my merry dear I roam. While the band is playing Dixie, I'm humming home sweet home. Be it ever so A blood-stained little note A bullet hole that pierced it through and through It began with darling Mary It 
if I don't come back again Just remember that my last thoughts were of you While the band is playing Dixie I'm humming home sweet home It takes me back to Georgia Though I'm far across the phone Once again beside the river With my merry dear I roam While the band is playing Dixie I'm humming home sweet home you to meet your number one fan, Mama Wilbur. <laughs> and we want you girls to come back and see us again, will you? Friends, remember our sponsors when you do your shopping this week. You've been wonderful. Bye-bye. Take care. We'll see you next week. Join us again next week, same time, same station, for another Wilburn Brothers show.